Welcome back friends. I hope everyone has the Excel with Power Query setup ready and also basic understanding of Excel formulas now. If not, please watch the previous two videos, part one and uh, part two. And uh, as already told, in this video, I'm gonna going to explain about how to fetch the live data of f and o stocks from the NSC website. Please note that this is not option chain data, but the uh, equity stock price of uh, f and o stocks. Okay, so before that, uh, let me explain some basic stuffs before going into that. Fine, so you all now know how to get the, uh, see the Nifty 50 stocks actually. So in the NSE website, go to live market and click equity stock and you can see the 50 stocks here. Okay, okay. So let me tell you one thing. This is actually a table data. Okay, so this data format is table. There is one more data format is called JSON. You just remember it as a JSON. You don't need to, uh, you know, concentrate much on what data type format it is. Or otherwise, you can just Google. It is kind of data interchange format. Okay, fine. Now, here you can see we have selected Nifty 50 and the URL is uh, NSE India live market all equity stock watch dot htm and it shows nifty 50 data and uh, Now we are going to get the data from f and o stocks So that is f o stocks you can select it from under others in the drop down Just click f o stocks You will get all the stocks here This kit change So here you can get almost uh, 212 stocks nearly Okay uh, I'm not sure whether uh, you have noticed this change because we have selected FO stocks here and uh, here the data also got changed but the URL didn't change. So in the Excel if you are giving this URL say for example I just copy paste and uh, pasting it in the new tab. Excuse me. <coughs> so you will get the nifty 50 only by default. Okay. So now let me tell you how to get this F4 stocks. Okay. Uh, so what you can do is if you are using Chrome browser, uh, first refresh this. So you will be there in Nifty 50 and just right click and click inspect. And here select network. And now select Nifty FO stocks. Okay. So in the right side, you can see what are all uh, the contents of the website getting loaded. So just scroll to the top. In the first one, you can see FO SEC stock watch dot JSON. You can just right click and give open in new tab okay so you will get the entire data of a post stock here and uh, this format is called uh, json format uh, don't worry about what is json and all those things it is just uh, data format okay uh, if you are not sure how to get this url uh, i will post this url under the description you can just use the url directly you no need to worry about much uh, about the what is inspect or what is all those things view source or it is not record so you need to concentrate on this url only similarly like uh, you can just to inspect if in case you are uh, trying to take the nifty bank you can just select nifty bank so under network you can see this is bank nifty you can just click open in new tab so this will open as a JSON format. Only bank Nifty stocks will be here. Okay, fine. So this is uh, options. I mean, FO stocks live price. Just copy the URL. And going forward, uh, I will use this URL for all the screeners what I'm going to create and what I'm going to show to you. So I will concentrate mainly on the FO stocks only. I'm not going to take all the stocks. And uh, if you have URL, it is very simple. You can just follow it. And if you're facing any issues or if you have any queries, you can always, you're always welcome to mention in the Telegram group. Okay. I'm just closing the existing seat. 
and opening a new one. Fine. Remaining everything is simple, just uh, like how we get the data from uh, uh, NSE data. Uh, you can just refer part one video as well. So click from web. Select basic and then the URL just paste the URL and click OK. And Excel will do the magic for you. It will parse the JSON data and will give you the uh, data in tabular format. Just hold on till it parsing it. My system it is taking some time. So it's establishing connection and it will get the data from there. Looks like running comment. Okay, so now it shows like uh, whatever uh, it parsed the data, the JSON data, and uh, it displayed it like you. Okay, and in this, we are concentrating much on we need to know about this data part. So just click on list, and you will get everything as a record. Okay, and once you got this record, click on two table. Please watch it uh, keenly, then only you will be able to do it. If you miss one step, uh, you may be missing something. Okay, just select default and click OK. So now everything is converted into a table format. And uh, now just click this one, this arrow, double arrow. We are expanding it. You can just uh, remove this, use original column name as a prefix and click OK. That's it. So you got all the data from NSE website that is F and O stocks. So the remain everything is symbol open high low last traded price percentage change percentage points change traded volume traded volume million and everything is there. Uh, in this you can just rename whatever you want and uh, this points change we need percentage change we need traded volume in lakhs it is not needed for us so just remove the column traded volume million is needed for us apart from that for our scanner uh, ntp m value weekly high weekly low week high i don't know what is this x date this is x dividend date and uh, custom accent something this one and yearly percentage and monthly percentage just remove it as it is not free needed for us okay and one more thing like uh, you can just rename it uh, just right click on the uh, header and just change it to with symbol as first letter as capital similarly you can change it to open this change it to high this as low this as last traded price this let it be this also let it be this also let it be okay so now we got all the data and uh, for uh, simplification of mathematical calculations uh, let us convert this data type into number say for example here open high low last traded price everything as a number Okay, but it will show as like uh, any type so better just select everything uh, To select everything just first click this column and press shift symbol shift key and Then select the last column so everything will get selected and then you can choose data type into decimal number it will be done okay so you can find nearly 2009 st sorry 209 stocks i guess yes okay just click uh, 
close and load or close and load to anything if you want to load to the first one click load this is done and you can do any verification steps if you want I always remove these grid lines okay so that's it you are having uh, all the FNDO stocks now say for example We have 40 stock open as 133.20 and last traded price is 147.60 and you can see here 147.60 assume that I am changing it to 150 and uh, when you do refresh this will get changed so it means live data it will get automatically changed and uh, i will show you how to do the auto refresh as well i think i already shown you can just uh, do that right just right click properties and refresh every one minute so even i just make change as 89 or 123 78 so after one minute this will get refreshed automatically okay and uh, I'm going to create all the scanners or screeners uh, using these stocks with uh, this set of stocks. So this is having around uh, total stocks which have uh, options as well. And and these are all which is uh, easily available in uh, NSE India website. That's why I have chosen this. If you want to take other data, so if you have any website or uh, NSE website, if wherever it is available, you can just follow the same process. Okay. And... Uh, Similarly, you can just see here 89, 123, 78. We just uh, changed it. We'll wait for one minute to get it uh, refreshed. Meanwhile, uh, this is the URL, and uh, I will post this URL in the description as well. And you can straight away use it uh, by uh, copying that URL and uh, put it in here from web, and just you can give that URL. It should be working. Or otherwise, uh, I have explained how I have taken that URL also. You can try that okay and see you can see this last traded price got changed automatically refreshed okay fine uh, so that's all with uh, fetching the data for f and o stocks from nsc website you can see the data here now and uh, in my next video i will explain how to fetch the historical data for uh, each stock okay uh, wait for it and uh, as usual say uh, please do subscribe comment like and share if you have any queries you can post it in the telegram group as well thank you so much for watching